Hi everyone, happy Valentine's Day. Laura here with another haul. This is a haul of this and that. Let me tell you, it's a few different stores. I even have a thrift store haul to share with you. I'm just gonna make one big video because I will be crafting this week. I want it out of my craft room and put away out of my way. I don't want to trip over this stuff anymore. <laughs> so I'm just gonna put it all in one video. Um, and you can, if you don't wanna see the thrift store video, that will be at the end, so just so you know. All right, so from the Dollar Tree, they have, you could tell by my thumbnail, they had the Arm & Hammer Body Wash, 12 fluid ounces, oh my goodness, this smells amazing, but I love anything juniper uh, smelling, so, or scent. So they had the, they had the juniper berry, the Simply Fresh, this one is so, this one is, oh my goodness. Mm. This one I can smell all through the store. Um, I, it must have leaked. Um, I don't know, but uh, this is amazing, guys. This is amazing. And then they had the Clean Water. I didn't smell this one. Oh, Clean Water. Kind of smells like detergent, <laughs> laundry detergent, but you know, I don't know. <laughs> but it smells nice. And then they also had the orange blossom. I've already smelled that. They're all very nice smelling. So yeah, that's a good buy for 12 fluid ounces for $1.25. So I, we're set on body washes for quite some time now. <laughs> so I got those. And then they had the facial wipes by Tada. Um, I want to see who distributes these. Cause it's a it's a really big pack it is by yes sales incorporated so you know it's not a green buyer and you get 80 sheets in here this is the rose petal i'm not going to open it and smell it because i may put these in gift baskets i'm not sure yet and then they have the tea tree and these are the only scents that i found but i'm going to look today i'm going back today and see if they've got any other um scents because that's a really good buy so i picked those up so that was it for the health and beauty and then i'm going to move on to uh i guess it would be the cleaning section they had the airwick the airwick scents i i mean that is a good buy dollar 25 right because what are these uh three four dollars even five dollars at walmart so they had the lavender and chamomile they had vanilla and papaya that one i'm i'm real interested in that one and then the fresh linen which i've had before they this is this smells really nice too so they had uh airway at the dollar tree so yeah when i was excited to show you all that i was excited to find it <laughs> okay Moving on to, I guess I'm gonna go to floral and get this off my desk here. Um, I just picked these up, these are not new, but I just wanted to show you something. So they had these stones, and this is a 32 ounce little bag of stones. Now, <clears throat> I'll be making something with this, and I needed some stones. So here is the small, let me, hopefully you can see. Hopefully you can see the size of the, I'm just gonna open it. Just gonna open it so you can see the size there. <clears throat> Small little snip there. So here's the size of these stones. So these, you know, will make a really nice, like in a vase or something like that. And then, but oh my gosh, I was so excited. Even the girl, the cashier, was like, "What? Look at five pounds of river rocks." I call them river rocks, but anyway, look at those big old rocks there. Five pounds for $1.25 that you cannot be, they were gone. I went the next day and they were gone because that is a great buy, guys. So if you see these, snag them. So yeah, black rocks, they're calling them. And this is by, uh, this is not a green briar, my glasses. This is a brand name uh, distributed by Flora Craft. Design, designitflowers.com. So that is a really great deal. Another exciting find at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> okay, so then um, sticking with the uh, 
garden department. I just picked up one of these feeders. Don't like these feeders. The hole is too big. It's nice for the hummingbirds, but the bees, it attracts the bees, so I don't typically use these. But I got this. I have a DIY in mind for this. So that's why I got that. And then I also picked up some more of these little pebbles. I like the, I, I like using these in my crafts. I think they're really nice. Um, they're just pebbles. Um, and these, how much, how much do you get here? 13.5 ounces. So these are really nice to have when you're crafting or gardening. They're even nice for gardening. So anyway, let's see. Anything else floral here? Nope. So I'm just going to move on. Well, this is in the garden department too, I guess. So they had the tractor. Hello Spring. I just could not pass that up. I think it's adorable. And then they had the Welcome Friends. So I picked those two up. These are the only two that they had. Oh wait, I take it back. They had a blue truck, but I have the blue trucks already and the red trucks and you know. So anyway, they had these out. I'm starting to put all their spring stuff in. So I'm getting excited for that. Whenever they start moving uh, their uh, items over, like they're moving like the Valentine stuff over to a regular aisle, you know, and they have, you know, the big wall display. I get like, oh my gosh, I cannot wait. I get, I get excited. <laughs> All right, I'm going to ramble. The only Easter items that I bought are this basket. Now, didn't they have the blue one too? Didn't they have blue and pink? They only had a ton of pink ones. I just thought it was adorable. I don't know what I'm going to do with her yet, but I'll figure something out. I just couldn't pass her up, and I got it before it's gone. And then <clears throat> St. Patrick's Day, I got these. Um, I don't really decorate for St. Pa Patrick's Day, but I got it for the hat, you know, for like maybe a snowman hat or something like that. And even the little shoes I can use, you know, uh, as an elf. You know, I don't know. I just got it for the pieces, so... I picked that up. I'm actually looking for the bigger hat, like the, the tinsel hat, because I want to do something with that at Christmas time as well. All right, so moving on, Crafters Square. I had never seen a canvas, a black canvas. I, I just, I don't know if I just have never noticed, never, you know, paid attention, but that's the only size that they had, and it is a, let's see, eight by eight. So yeah, I picked that up just to keep in my craft room. You never know when I need something like that. And then they had these iron-on art. I thought they were beautiful. They had a tiger and a butterfly, I think. They had a few different ones, but I only got the heart. Don't have to use these as iron-on. You can use these in your crafting as well. So I picked two of those up. And that was it for the crafter square. Okay. And then in the stationery... Oh my goodness, I had to dig. I had to dig for these. Uh, I guess somebody was looking at it, didn't put it in the right spot, but these were buried in the back. I was like, oh, you little stinky, sneaky little employees at the Dollar Tree hiding stuff from me. <laughs> I'm just teasing, I'm teasing. But I was, I was like, oh, what? Look at this, <clears throat> it's a llama. And it's a book, it's a hard book, and you open it up, it's got, you know, four little pages there of sticky notes. How adorable is that? How adorable. I'm always using sticky notes, and but this makes a really great gift, you know. You could just give them, you know, something like this with some candy and some flowers. I don't know. Uh, uh, put it in a basket. Super, super cute. And then they ha also had the cherries which is adorable as well. The llama one has just got me though. So when I go back today, I will be searching for more. I'm sure there is more designs here, but these are the only two that I could find. And then look how super cute these are. I don't know if they're new, but I just thought they were super cute. This says, um, eat lemon. No. Yeah, eat lemon. And then, but look, it's got, the front has like a little cutout. So the picture's there, and then they got the cut out there, and I just thought that was really cute. It's just regular lined paper. Like, I need, 
I need paper like I need. I mean, I've got a whole basket full of paper. I forgot to put it in my Christmas basket, so I am good on paper, but I couldn't resist because it's just adorable. Fat burning water, lemon, and ginger. How cute is that with the mason jar? So yeah, I mean, I could even cut this this page out and do something with that in a DIY. So super, super cute. Anyway, got that. And then for, uh, the only florals that I got were um, some more of this greenery. I DIY with these quite a bit. And then they had the all the little berries out. I only got the green. Um, $1.25, I'm not, you know, I think twice now about the flowers because you can get the flowers at Walmart for 97 cents still. So for now. And then they had a really beautiful vase out. This is really pretty. It's got little, you know, dots on it, raised dots. I thought that was very pretty. So I just picked one up just to have it. You never know. And then in the, um, what is that? You know, where you have all the serving, the, uh, you know, the serving bowls and um, it's on the tip of my tongue. I can't remember right now. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, when you know when you when you get sir you get it uh, the catering. Oh my goodness! I'm telling you, I still have the Rona brain. I'm not kidding. It's like it's real. It is real. I mean, I did test negative, but I don't really trust the, those tests too well because I had all the symptoms. I was very very sick. But anyway. Moving on, I don't want to ramble. Uh, this is a two piece and I just like that shape and I thought maybe I can make something with that. And then they also had this shape. And I don't remember this size. And I know that they have a smaller size, but this one is a uh, much taller. It's got the scalloped edges. So I just picked that up because I did, I thought it was cute. Easter, you know, so anyway. Anything scalloped reminds me of Easter. Isn't that weird? <laughs> so, anyway, moving on. Toys. My last items of the Dollar Tree haul. They had these flying sloths. And these reminded me of um, Allie, Allie over at um, DP's Wonderful World. If you have not checked her out, go check her out. She's, she's really fun to watch. And she's a really, really nice person. But anyway, she loves sloths. And I, I thought of her. But these are so cute. I got it for the grandkids, so yeah, I got three of them. That way my older son, my disabled son, can play with them too. So I picked those up, and then we've already played with these. Um, let's see, they had the uh, Bulldog, which we've already uh, uh, played with, and then they have the Penguin, and they're, it's Air Doe, and it was so much fun to do. It's got the directions on the back, so you know, uh, it's easy to do with the kids and show them how to make it. And it's got, let's see, who distributes this? Oh, this is Greenbrier. Okay, well, it's a really, really nice product. You get three different colors in your in your bag, but it shows you how to mix the colors to make, you know, the colors that you need as well. So anyway, they had the penguin with the little baby penguin. And then they have this little guy. Not sure what he is. Avocado. Oh, okay. Avocado. And then they had the unicorn. So I just thought those were so fun. And it was fun. It was fun. So anyway, we got those. <clears throat> and that was it for the Dollar Tree haul. Okay. So the only things that I got from Walmart were the flowers. So I was mentioning earlier about the flowers. They're only $0.97 at, the, at Walmart. So, um, yeah. Yeah. I've been getting a lot of my flowers from Walmart. So I do have more that um, are still in the garage. I haven't even put away yet, but I got these two. So I'm just gonna show you these two in this haul. And these are just called uh, Queen Anne Lace. Queen Anne's Lace. So I did pick those up. And then that was it. And then from Big Lots, I had picked up these pits. These were only $2.50. Um, I will be uh, putting my lemon uh, uh, decor back in my kitchen as soon as I uh, put my Valentine's away. And um, yeah, I'll probably incorporate Easter with my lemon. I'm not sure yet, or I may not. I don't know. But 
got that from Big Lots. And then from Marshalls, no, where did I get this? Oh, this is not Marshalls. This is from the grocery outlet. Um, so, so cute. Um, I, there we go. I can't remember how much this was. I want to say $7.99 or $6.99. It was the last one, so I nabbed it. How cute is that? It's just got, you know, the pebbles on the bottom. Um, totally my style, and I just love that light bulb. We never got the light bulbs at my Dollar Tree, so let's see if we get them this year. <laughs> so anyway, if we do, I'll be making some stuff with them because I just think it's so cute. And this one lights up, which is nice. So anyway, got that. And then I also got these Mason uh, snack bowls, and I just thought they were really cute. And these were $4.99, I believe. I should have kept the receipt. Um, something in that area, but even if we don't use these for snacks, um, honestly, that's too small. <laughs> I'm just going to be honest right now. These are really small snack bowls, but they make nice like salsa, you know, things like that. Uh, dipping for dipping. Um, but I can always craft with these. So these would make really cute. And I did buy this just uh, in case I do make like um, something with some succulents for my tear tray this year for spring. So we'll see about that. All right, moving on. Uh, finally to Marshall's. I got so excited. Let me show you what I got. This is $4.99. Typically, I would not pay this. I would not pay $4.99 for a mug. But what? <laughs> it was adorable. And I'm really liking the bigger mugs now because... Um, I'm putting whipped cream. I know I'm being bad. I put whipped cream in my coffee and it's so delicious. So, and I did the, I just could not pass this up. So I used part of my Christmas money to buy this mug. How cute is that? They had more designs, but that's the one that I got. And then, oh, here we go. I couldn't remember what I paid for the canister. The canister was only $7.99. She it was the last one there, and she gave it to me for $7.99. There was no price on it. How cute. So she stuck a sticker on there for me and took it up front. How cute. It's got the uh, silver rabbit on there, the metal rabbit. Um, this is going to really add uh, some decor to my kitchen. It's just my style. So, yeah, I thought that was beautiful. Okay. So I got that. I need that receipt. And then the la last item before I move on to the thrift store item is, I know uh, Valentine's is over, but I found this. I just couldn't pass it up for a dollar at the Dollar General because maybe I can, you know, maybe cut out the um, hearts or something and use these gnomes in other projects. So I did get that. Uh, how adorable. How adorable. Okay. Moving on to my thrift store haul. So if you want to click off now, not interested in thrift store hauls, then now would be the time. Thank you so much for visiting. And uh, if you have, if you like what you're seeing, um, I hope you consider subscribing to my channel. Glad to have you here. Okay, moving on to my thrift store haul. Now you know this is nothing, nothing uh, major, but I did get them to craft with. It's only 50 cents, so I picked that up. As you can see, I was kind of, I had my tiered tray in mind when I was picking these things up. This is a little sugar uh, canister. It looks like maybe it had a lid. It's gone. Um, One dollar. And look how cute this is. This will definitely be going on my tiered tray. I'll be painting it up. And this was only 25 cents. So I got that. And then again, Tear tray. I'll be changing that up as well. Uh, 10 cents. I got that. And then, uh, let's see. Oh, my biggest find at the, the thrift store was, what? A dollar. I got this for a dollar and I thought, it's really light. So I thought, did somebody make this in, in you know, wood shop? How did they get the, the glass in there? You know, wow, that is really unique. So I, I grabbed it right away, put it in my cart. When I got home, this thing is expensive. I think it was like $29.99 to begin with, and it's on sale right now. But, um, yeah, amazing. So, yeah, I, I'm so glad that I got it. Don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. 
um, it's for um, seedlings. So you can actually grow your little uh, seeds in these bottles and then transplant them. So yeah, thought that was cute. So yeah, that was my major find at the thrift store. And then for $1.50 for the whole set, I just picked these up again. It just reminds me of Easter. I can maybe craft with these. Um, you never know. And for $1.50, you get four of them. I thought that was a good deal. And then I am starting to, I watch um, Gina Can Craft, or I think it's Gina Can Craft. She's um, a really great, uh, another great, uh, creator on YouTube. I love watching her. Um, if you haven't checked her out, go check her out too. I will link um, uh, some channels down in my description area if you want to go check those out. But anyway, she gets me excited about stamping, about uh, cardstock. <laughs> she just gets me excited. So um, I'm just, I've been kind of stocking up on my stamps and I got a stamp pad and I'm going to give it a try and see what, you know, see what I can do with them um, in terms of crafting. I'm not really a paper crafter. So, but anyway, uh, rambling. For $2, I got a wonderful holiday season. So that's what the stamp will look like. So I got that one. And then this is a lamp post. thought that was super cute. Now, these say uh, $2 on it, but she gave them to me for way cheaper because um, I think it was like, uh, 75 cents or something so I got those and then this is a um, it's just got hearts and like little little shapes there uh, kind of a country kind of uh, border so I got that one <clears throat> and then I just got this chick it was there it was a dollar and I just thought it was cute it's a palm pet you know it's supposed to do things so I just thought the grandkids would get a kick out of that so I picked that up and then lastly, I picked this basket up. It was a dollar. I was like, what? It's, I mean, yeah, I'll be doing something with this. I don't know if I'm going to leave it this color or change it up. I'm not sure yet, but what a great deal that was. So that was it for my haul today. I know it was just a lot. It was this and that, but I, like I said, I just want it out of here. <laughs> so anyway, Thank you all for watching my video today. And if you are new and you uh, stayed till the end, uh, I hope you could uh, consider subscribing, like I said before. And welcome to my channel. Thank you so, so much, everyone. And I will talk to everyone in my next video. Bye for now. Oh, and happy Valentine's Day again. Mm -hmm.